Okay, now that we have our Mako 2 connected up to our MFU, uh, we might want to change some of the default settings. And in this case, it would be wise to do so because we've connected up to a Tajin MFU. So we need to optimize the Mako to run, well, as uh, connected up to a Tajin unit. So to do that, we use a Sony TV remote controller. Now, you can get uh, any universal remote control. Uh, here's one here. Here's my favorite, my nice big one that I got from uh, Aldi. Um, so, if we want to change from uh, Heng Long to a Tajin MFU, we press the button 9. Okay. Now, in the uh, Mako manual, you'll see the settings for all the other, other numbers. But uh, just for this little video, I want to just make sure that we're operating as a Tajin MFU on the Mako. And I'm going to show you how to program that at startup. So, with your remote controller in hand, turn your tank on. And remember, we'll need to press that button during the startup period, i.e. when the indicator LED on the Mako board is solid red. So we'll just fire up. Okay. Now, solid red, press 9. Okay. That's been accepted. It goes back into programming mode in case we want to choose another setting. So we've now set our Mako up to operate uh, properly well with the Tajin MFU.